Taylor literally just looked at me and said, Brooke, get filming. That's all I am to her. That's a joke. <laughs> Here, you're storing this too. What? You got a bigger bag. I have a micro purse. You're the birthday girl. You tell us what's happening because this was your plan and idea. Yeah, we're going to the States to go shopping because I want to go to a Target. Like, <laughs> we're literally... <laughs> then, How long? Yeah. When are we driving all the way to America? Let's go to Target. Shut up. Target is our pride and joy. Yeah. She is the main show stopper. <laughs> Everybody have their passports? Yes. Okay, this whole entire time I'm going to interview Brock. Do you want me to hold it for you? No, I know my best ankles. Oh, okay. <laughs> We'll see you when we're in America. Cause what's the point of filming anything now? Yeah. He wants to know. Okay, goodbye. Bye. Bye. Where are we? Damn it! I almost said it. <laughs> almost yeah, at the border. We're getting there, almost. and I have to wait for them. Chat. This is the moment we've all been waiting for. Target! Target. Target. <laughs> There's Brooke, she's shopping. <laughs> all my stuff's on the floor, but this is what I was looking at already. So I found these cute shorts. I need to try them on. But then I saw these fall sweaters online, and then I found them here. And I like the cable knit of this. I think it's so cute. And then I found this striped one. so cute. But I'm going to look like a purple freak because we got purple everywhere. <laughs> It's just such a peaceful vibe when you come in here. It's just like zen. The only thing is, is like my hair is not right right now, so everything I try on looks like trash. That's my try on, huh? Oh, we're in the shoe aisle. I'm looking for very specific shoes. Brooke, show them the cute boots you found. Oh, let me know if you see a six. Of what? Of those. They are six. Is that the only pair so far that you found that are that size? Oh, I just don't know how often I would wear those. I'm, I'm really looking for like the knockoff Birkenstock books. I feel like a mom right now and you're my child. I'm stressed out. No. Not what I'm looking for. Taylor's on a mission. No. Look at this. Nope, I'm in the men's aisle. <laughs> well, that's disappointing. These little cowboy boots. Okay, I'm actually so annoyed I don't see the clogs. Neither do I. Well, nobody said Target shopping would be easy. No, I feel like I'm scared of what you're gonna do. <laughs> look at us going up and down that. Like, this is what we look like. Ow, you're squishing my finger. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> look at this bruise on my arm. Like this is ridiculous. I look ugly. Oh. You do that on your own already, sweetie. <laughs> okay, no more rides for you. No. We're gonna give you guys a quick update of literally everything that's in the cart. She's full. I found this really cute quilt, but I think I'm gonna put it back because I have to be reasonable. And it's so nice though. That's tough for me. That's tough. This blanket, I'm really considering. It's a dark green. And it's Close. nice. Literally the most random stuff. Then I have shoes in here. Picture frames. Right. Like really <gasps> big picture frames. I have a vision. Well, do you like maybe a haul at the end or something? A I book. A book for me. So it has a shit ton of clothes. I literally have so much. Our cart is very full. And I have like these really cute sets that I want to try on. So to the fitting room. Let's go. <laughs> We're in Hobby Lobby. And this is losing our minds. Meg, hey. this is insane. We're used to Michaels, and we think Michaels is is crazy. This this is this is, this is on crack. Oh okay. my god! Look at this. What the hell? And they get up like a whole what the fuck? Look at America these. has everything, like Look everything. Look at these. What the heck? Come on, like, are you joking? That is so cute. They just like it just goes on for miles. Look at this side too. There's a lot to look at. There's so much to look at. Next stop, five below. Bro, five. you should be in there because you're five and below. I'm five foot four. No, I mean like out of a scale like one to ten, like you're five and below. <laughs> it 
it's so spooky coated. <laughs> We now happen to be in one of the great, this lighting is doing nothing for me. We happen to be in one of the greatest stores and that's Kohl's and, oh, no, TJ Maxx, my bad. <laughs> we happen to be in a great store and it's TJ Maxx. We have stuff like this at home, but at the same time, this is kind of better. And I'm a huge Juicy Couture fan right now, as everybody knows, and I need to show you all the juicy they have. I'll be right back. It's literally so chaotic out there. I have stuff. Whew, we're in the dressing room. Peace. Let's begin. You can't really see well, but okay, this is the first sweater. I don't know if I like the sleeves, if they're too big. I need Brooke's opinion. Brooke, I need your opinion. I'm Asian. Oh. <laughs> I like the colors and the stripes, but I don't think I like the shape. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Put the shorts. Put on a skirt. What is this? <laughs> okay, right. Okay, me. Oh, the belly. Yeah. I don't think I like the sleeves though. Why not? Like I feel like they're too much. Yeah. But it'd I'm be like so a fly away. I'm like a it'd be too much sleeve. Yeah, too much sleeve. Alright, well. On to the next one. This is really hard to tell what it looks like with blue shorts, but I feel like this could look nice with black jeans. Alrighty, Brooke's got a cute dress on. So cute. Look cute. Looks good for grades. And Kirsten has a cute sweater. So that is cute. Even that one that going home across the border, gotta get some Dunkin' Donuts. So cute. We love it. Hey guys, we're back from our shopping trip. It's been a couple days, but now we're excited. We're gonna go through each store and what exactly we did buy because that day was kind of chaotic and I don't even really know how much we filmed, but. So the first store we went to was Target. We were so excited to go. We're big Target girlies, and of course we don't have it in Canada anymore. So let's start with Target. Let's start off, I got this big ass picture frame, but I got two of them. And they're gonna go up in my room. And then to go behind it, I got these cute fairy lights. And I already put them up and they look gorgeous. You're looking luminous. Ooh, let me re-say that then. And they're looking luminous. <laughs> luminous. Oh no, it's leaking. We knew that, bro. No, I fixed it and then it really fell out my clothes. Okay, anyway. I got this tree hut body scrub in the scent. I almost said coconut because it's such a default. <laughs> Pumpkin spice latte and it smells really good. You're gonna use it in your shower. It smells exactly like fall, like that's so good. And tree hut, all the girlies are using it right now. Yeah, and we don't have tree hut, I don't think. Um, I got just basics from Target, so I got this cute long sleeve, it's just white. I got a brown cami that's really cute because it has a little hole in the back with a bow. And I love bows and it has buttons and a little bit of lace. And I also really like brown. Taylor convinced me that brown is our color. I think brown is our color. The last thing I got was another long sleeve but this one has more of a scoop neck. It's not as white and it looks really nice with necklaces. Target, I went crazy. That's where I spent the most money. I mean, I started off with cookies. <laughs> like, she's got some And left. I still have two left. We can each have one. Can we have one right now? No, not on my bed. <laughs> Please, I really want No! Look, like, every time I go shopping, I need a snacky, so. She basically bought them for me because I was complaining a lot. Brooke was complaining a lot, and I was like, do you want me to buy you food? And she was like, no. But then gave me the eyes. I'm <laughs> like, yeah, you do. I got this blanket. It's so nice. It's this really pretty green color. It's all knit and it looks great for fall. I can't wait to put it on my bed oh, me and make my room all fallish. I got some clothes because I did some some Target TikTok research and I've seen what the girlies were buying and this looks so cute on so many people. It's this really cute zip. I haven't, I've yet to seen it on you and I really want to. Mom, it's really cute so. I then got this brown tank top because once again, I do believe brown is our color. It's a bit longer which I'm really loving right now. The crop stuff is out. Normal length is in. And then I found this cute little ghosty. He was in the dollar section. He was $5, but it lights up. You see him glowing? Hardly. And then I got two books. As everybody knows, I do love to read and they're cheaper in America. So I got Icebreaker and then I also got The Silent Patient, which should be kind of spooky for fall time. Mm. I'm really excited. They were both 20% off. And then the cashier also looked them up online for me and they were only $11 each. And in Canada, they were supposed to be $21.99 and $24.99. That was my target run. Next stop was Hobby Lobby. So I got a lot of craft stuff there. And I got this insane stack of paper and it's insane and I'm gonna use it for scrapbooking and I got it on sale. I got a cute pack of stickers which is very 
Barack. I watch journaling ASMR at night to fall asleep sometimes, and that's the type of stuff I use. I'm honestly kind of glad I didn't go down those aisles because I probably would have bought more stuff. Yeah. Two different types of ribbon. I got a white one and a pink one, and I'm gonna put them in some new shoes as shoelaces. And last thing I got was a little decor for my room, and it's this little mushroom that hangs. And that was my Hobby Lobby shop. It was insane. I got literally all that for $24. That's crazy. I know. I spent a lot of money on Saturday. I'm not gonna lie, like I spent a lot of money. <laughs> oh my god, it's gonna take me out bringing it up. The first thing that I got from Hobby Lobby was this very cute turtle. And he's kind of like made out of tin and stuff. And it's just a wall decor. My room is beach themed, so it's very perfect. Next up, I went for fall decor. Sorry, right. yawn right in the camera. <laughs> Next up, I went for fall decor. I'm just really excited to decorate for my room for fall this year. And I don't have that much stuff, so I kind of went in a little, a little up there. You don't have a lot of fall stuff for your room? I don't know. I don't think I do. <laughs> Are you for real? So I'm you're dead ass. <laughs> Open your bin and be like, fuck. Fuck, I do. Think about that huge statue you have. Of but a that's Halloween candy. decor, not fall decor. <laughs> Halloween happens in fall, it's October. <laughs> I want my October. room to first be dark academia okay. vibes and then transition to Halloween. Got this pumpkin. <laughs> just stab my eye out. <laughs> it's hard. <laughs> Ew, I fucking hated that. No, t anyway, it's kind of sparkly, so it gets sparkles everywhere. It looks like but for a nap. That's why I still have it. <laughs> really? The fall decor? Why do you look so short? <laughs> because I'm sitting cross <laughs> Let me preface though that all the fall stuff in Hobby Lobby was 40% off, so <laughs> I was getting discounts. Next up, I got this really cute candle holder, and it's um like a dark orange color, brown, $15.99, but 40% off. So why did keep you it need mind. that? Huh? Oh. <laughs> to go on my bookshelf because I'm so sick of my bookshelf not really having a theme on top and it doesn't. I like the way yours looks. I was gonna so say. So I kind of got stuff that reminded me of you. Oh, That is so cute. Anyway. My heart. Which kind of explains this head. <laughs> <laughs> this looks like Brooke. <laughs> that looks like me. It's a man. <laughs> is it? Whatever, I don't give a fuck, okay? <laughs> I just wanted one of those like armless head statue people. Like I kind of wanted a bigger one, so this one is a little bit small. But anyway, it's just like, it looks Roman and it just classy. And I got this huge candle holder, dude. It's heavy, it's like murder weapon. It's so fucking heavy. Anyway, um, another candle holder, but it's gold. I thought it would look really cute as well with this whole theme, you know what I'm saying? Lastly, it kind of was like a little silly willy, but um, Christmas stuff was 50% off, which is crazy and I couldn't really say no. So I got this really cute set of candy canes because my room is pink and blue during the Christmas season. And then these like little faux cookies that are ornaments. How freaking cute. I couldn't pass them up. Five Below. Five Below was the weirdest experience I ever had. I was expecting much more dollar store vibes, but Me it too. gave icing clairs. It, it was, was so weird. strange. But I got a t-shirt from there and this one's funny cause it's brats. And I'm not sure yet if I'm gonna keep it as a t-shirt or if I'm gonna cut it and make it like off the shoulder, like cute. Yeah. And then I got these Hello Kitty socks because I'm really into Hello Kitty lately and they're pink. I got cookies from there yeah. to eat, but those are gone. <laughs> That's all for me. I too got a t-shirt from Five Below and it just says explore together with like random little animals and like a unicorn and stuff. I just thought it was a funny t-shirt for like a Five Below store. I don't know, really random. And then I got these Asian, oh, oh. they were so gross. You didn't like them? It was like, the, I had no idea what I was buying, but they ended up being these like strawberry chocolate things. Oh, look at the case they come in for one. They look like a package of little mini eggs. Pop them off. Tastes like strawberry, that smells good. Mm, Taylor. Okay. <laughs> but look how weird this is. They oh. literally pop out. Oh fuck. It's, <laughs> I like you it. eating one right now? So I wasn't allowed to eat a cookie? Cause those are bigger. <sighs> this one's in my mouth, it makes no crumbs. And then we went to Olive Garden for lunch, which was delicioso. And then lastly, we went to TJ Maxx. I didn't realize it's like a winner's, but I should have. But cheaper. Yeah. I got this really pretty top. It reminds me it's of like gorgeous. coquette vibes. That's what I was shopping for. I can make little ribbons on my shoulders or bows, and it's really pretty. I and really it goes that. really nice with this cute green cargo skirt. Ooh. I literally wanted a cargo skirt, so I was super happy I found How one. How's your booty fit in this? I don't, it's or, short. It is short, but I like my stuff short. Also with that green skirt, I have this like white knit top 
that has little buttons. Brooke is so good at seeing the vision for things. Like you, you pick out the best stuff, honestly. Thank you. I, I put it. it together and it looks like the cutest hippie outfit ever. I love it. With necklaces. Yeah. Good. And then last, because I needed to feel extra that day, I found a juicy couture section and Taylor loves juicy couture. But I found this house coat and it's pink and it has a hood and it's super comfy and it says juicy all over it. <laughs> it's and so fluffy. I really just wanted it so I could do my makeup in the morning before work all nice and cozy. That's An extra girly why. pink. Fun. Whoa. For me from TJ Maxx, I just got a, two things. Brooke found me this skirt, which is really cute. It looks like this. It's kind of like midi length. There's a slit. It makes it a little scandalous. <laughs> um, but it looks really cute with my high tops. I got the platform white one, so... Delicioso. And then my pride and joy. Brooke found me what I've wanted for so long. Juicy sweatsuits. It, sweatpants. What the fuck am I saying? They say juicy and rhinestones on the butt. And they go straight down into just like a regular so old school type of fucking sweatpants and honestly they're so cute i was looking at photos on pinterest and all the celebrities in the 2000s used to wear these i really just need the zip up hoodie now mm -hmm. and i will be perfect and set a french man ready to go so yeah i just i really love them Mark looks so good on blondes i, I love too. it I know. that was our big shopping spree we honestly did spend a lot of money on ourselves but For we one deserve day, it yeah we had a really great time thanks america we posted a um a little bit on our stories from that day so you should be following us on instagram because when we're doing stuff like that we are posting on our stories, so thanks for shopping with us. Woo. Two little Canadian girlies out in the American world. And we Making survive. our dreams come true. Okay, cool. have a great weekend. Love you. Bye. Please subscribe. We're so close to 50K. We are.